take a look of how we can make guitar chords I'm gonna use presence and guitar nylon guitar and we can still use the chord track I'm just gonna go for let's say D minor and G so we're gonna drag those down now for guitar since the voicings are a little different I found the simplest way to do it now on piano we would just uh, do one octave here and one octave here now we're gonna take this note press salt and drag it to the same note below and then do the same thing with the last note so let's do the same here we take the top note and then the lowest So what we can do from now on, um, we can just cut those notes around. So once we're happy with what we have, Can add another presence, and what we're gonna do, we're gonna click here, and now we can see the ghost notes of the chords, and we can place let's do. We can place notes over those chords. We could also transpose those one octave. So what we're going to do next, uh, I'm going to add some reverb. And I think Empire is on all versions of Studio One, so... Let's drag this, find a clean sound. Let's see how it sounds with some drums. Okay, so I tried to add some RC20, but my PC can handle it. I mean, it's because I'm uh, recording, so I would normally use that as well. So to test this out, I added some perks and 
a horn sample and it now sounds like this <laughs> It's a little like uh, Cuban and Central C type beat. So yeah, that's basically how you draw guitar chords and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.